Well, today we're doing something a little different. Paddling on the uh, the Ottawa River above Chats Fall Dams. We're in a little conservation area near Armfryer. Absolutely beautiful. Lots of people out uh, hiking on the trails, our hiking trails here. What a gorgeous place. Unfortunately, I did not bring a, uh, a holder for my cell phone, so, so I'll not be able to paddle and film at the same time. What a beautiful spot. I'm doing a, a one-handed paddle here. Quite a bit of current here. Well, not a lot of current, but a bit of current. I guess the river narrows at the bridge. And I suppose there's always a bit of a flow through the dam. current really flows here. Yeah, there's still quite a bit of current up here, but there's the Ottawa River opening up, and up there I think I see the town of Armprior, where that church steeple is. And now we just slide back. Look at how fast we're going. Hey, for once you can see the bottom in the Ottawa, <laughs> usually the Ottawa River, at least down on like the Shane area. It's all silty brown. You can actually see rocks. Good sailing. So my kayak is a Delta 18 and I bought this kayak quite a few years ago um, because I needed you know, I'm a big guy and I have big feet, <laughs> so I wear size 14 shoes and I find most kayaks, even uh, the larger ones, uh, won't accommodate my feet. This one has um, quite a bit of space, so it's, uh, it's, got a, uh, it's got a rudder, which I like. I know the purists don't like them, but I like it, especially when you're paddling into the wind. And it's a great sea kayak. It's got two storage compartments, one forward up there and one aft right behind me there. And the cockpit is uh, is very good, very uh, very secure when you're uh, you know in bad weather. You put on a skirt and uh, it's just fine, very protected. Looks like there's another little nook to explore up there. There's some kids fishing off a rock there. Easterly wind today. Let's go see what's around the bend. Here, I can't resist little notches and inlets. I just cannot resist. Yeah. 
Mm, the uh, little bay here is redolent with the uh, earthy smell of the forest. It's wonderful. But there's lots of antioxidants in that. Some other paddlers up there. Ooh, the bay seems to go on. Let's go have a look. Right up here are a couple of turtles sunning themselves. See if we can get close. Very small. Oops, sorry guys. That little guy. They're probably saying, damn, he spotted us. More turtles sunning themselves, but I'm not going to bother them. I feel really bad about the other ones. Oh, no. Check it out. I think, I think people do go paddling in there. That wire is pushed down. I just lifted my rudder. I just want to have a peek. Just a quick peek. Too tempting. Wow. It's a neat area. It's kind of like a whole back country of water and little islands. I want to take that little channel, see where that goes. Looks like it gets quite shallow. But not scrape my bottom, although it's a pretty tough bottom. What a cool back country. And that was not a greasy log, folks. It was a pile of rocks. It's okay. Wow. This is so neat. Another little inlet, very secluded. Mm. 
What's that up there? Could that be a very narrow passage? I don't know if I'd make it through that, but I can always pull up my rudder and have a look-see. Could it be? <laughs> I have to kind of pull my way through. But I'll be darned. Look at that. Wow. What a beautiful passage. This is the best passage I've ever done in my whole life. Very, very, very cool. Look at that. I have a straight shot for the dam. Wow. That is amazing. That's where we came from.